Hey everybody, welcome. Thank you for joining us tonight. We're collaborating with Winters Jazz Club to bring you some music from the backyard. This is how we do it, folks. This is making music in the city, making happy faces and happy people come together. So uh, we're gonna get started with a song by the late, great Ellis Marsalis. I had the pleasure of playing this song with Victor Goins. Uh, we did a live stream for the Jazz Club Snug Harbor that was a tribute to Ellis's music. Um, I was very honored to be part of that. And that's when I learned this tune called Syndrome. <laughs>
Oh, man, not everyone has a pool full of fans in the backyard. That's all I've got to say. All right, uh, okay, so our next song, uh, next tune, next selection, uh, was written by Jerome Richardson, who was one of the original members of the Thad Jones Mel Lewis Big Band. Uh, I'm choosing this song for several reasons. One, because it's just a swinger and it's really fun. Um, and then also there's a, there's a different reason, too. Um, my Facebook feed has been full of people who've lost their fathers for the last two days. Um, cousin, a friend, colleague, and a colleague who's in hospice. I mean, not to, not to bring the world down. But uh, I would like to recognize the fathers that are still with us, notably uh, Larry Bennett, father of this one back here, Ryan Bennett. Um, because uh, Ryan likes to share these memories with me of, oh, I used to listen to this song with my dad when I was a little kid, and I was like, what a hip dad. Um, so I like to imagine them in the basement with the turntable and the vinyl and all these fastidious, well taken care of things. <laughs> um, so anyway, this is Groove Merchant by Jerome Richardson.
Lisa too. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Ah, uh, okay. Well, we could do the hard song next. Do we want to do the hard song next? Yeah, let's do it. Let's do the hard song. <laughs> This is the hard song. Actually, before we do the hard song, let me introduce everybody to you, please. This, on the drums, is Ryan Bennett. <laughs> and over here on the bass, Joshua Ramos. My name is Joanne Doherty. Oh, yes, thank you very much. We are thrilled to be with you tonight, and I have no idea if that wind is noisy in the microphone, but these are the things we learn when we have a show called Reinvention. Um, okay, this one is one I wrote quite a while back, and it is called Transmutation. Transmutation.
I'm checking in with technical support to see if everything's going okay out front. Because we have help from friends. Everything's cool. Super awesome. Awesome. So, uh, so Ryan had all that fire in his playing because he spent the last 12 hours plugging things in. No, I'm joking. Um, but there's a lot of tech to do something like this from home. Um, and we're not only the musicians, but we're kind of like the lighting people and the, the microphone people and the, the engineers. I have never missed engineers, sound engineers, so much in my life. Oh my goodness. Ah, okay. Well, after a song like that, I think I, think I want to talk about dads again because I didn't want it to be sad. But this song reminds me of my dad, and we play it a lot. Um, a lot is figurative, though, because, you know, these are the times they are. So anyway, this is one of my favorites, and it is uh, by the songwriter Jimmy Webb, and Glenn Campbell made it famous, and it's Wichita Lineman.
Thank you. So lots of hydrating. It's hot out here. But, oh, man, I'm glad it's still hot out here because the time is coming where we're all going to go back inside and we're going to have to figure out another way to do this. Chicago has just exploded in yard music this year. The South Side has been full of concerts in the alleys and people's yards. And all over, here we are in the inner collar burbs. I don't know what we are, but, but it feels like the city here, too. And we like to make music for our neighbors and for everyone else. Um, okay, moving on. I, okay, so Winters, okay, my favorite, one of our favorite places to play. And Scott, one of the greatest guys to work with. Um, there was also a bartender there who was excellent. All of them were excellent. But she, she gave me a little insight one day, and she said, you know, I'm not sure if you're charmingly awkward or awkwardly charming. <laughs> so I'm like, I'm right in between there somewhere, I think. I don't know. It's the best I can hope for. I'm real, though. Um, okay, so this next song is uh, something, okay, so earlier this year, which we called the Before Times, before the Great Pause, <laughs> the Before Times, uh, I had the privilege and honor, hey George, how are you, um, to travel to Havana, Cuba to make music at the Jazz Festival with Victor Goins Band. Um, and we got to spend a lot of time with a couple called the Masseys and um, really miss them. Um, and I know this song, I wrote this song as soon as I got back. Um, and I know Mr. Massey, Dr. Massey, loves it very much. Uh, so this one's for him. It is called Home from Havana.
<laughs> Woo. Okay, home from Havana. Um, that was in February, really right before it all began. Um, we had actually started hearing about the, the thing that shall remain unnamed, but it was not raging yet. Um, okay, so it wouldn't be one of my sets without a song by Stevie Wonder. Um, yeah, woo, from the crowd. Um, and this one is a heartbreaker. It's called Lately.
That's one of those songs that's just so right that you don't, I don't even need to improvise on it. I just want to hear it and play it. I want to put it on like a sweater, not like a sweater right now. I jump into it like a pool today. Uh, not a sweater today. Uh, okay. All right. We're going to do a few more, just a couple more, actually. Um, so um, of other loves in my musical life, Stevie Wonder and Al Jarreau. Uh, this is a, woo, woo, Al Jarreau in the, in the gallery over here. Uh, this one's a little lesser known, so I'll be testing out your true fandom. Uh, it's from the album Ella's for Lover, and it's called Says. And.
Oh, thank you very much. Ooh, yes, Algero, Algero. Um, okay, so we are uh, near the end of our presentation tonight. So I would like to thank everybody for coming to our live stream, our virtual jazz club for Winters Jazz Club. Thank you, Winters, for sponsoring this series. Uh, special shout out to Greg on some technical help over here because it takes a village. It does take a village. Um, and also to my compadres, Ryan Bennett on the drums. Joshua Ramos on the bass. I'm Joanne Doherty. Thank you, thank you. www.joannedoherty.com. <laughs> and, uh, you know, merchandise for sale at all the usual outlets. Uh, virtual tip jar listed, you know. I gotta say, every bit helps right now, folks. I mean, we are very fortunate to, um, you know, to feel safe in our home and full. Uh, but it is a hard time for artists right now. Um, so keep us all in your prayers because we're all trying to figure out what world we're returning to, as so many others are too. Um, so we need a world with art, and I think it's obvious now, it's very obvious now that we all need to just feel some good things together, bring people together, bring people who don't look alike together, bring people who can love each other together. Um, and I hope that our music does that. That's what we intend to do. Um, okay, our last selection is by the great teacher and composer Alvin Batiste, who was uh, based in Baton Rouge in Louisiana um, and New Orleans. It was um, a teacher of Branford Marsalis and of my colleague Victor Goins um, and many, many, many others who came out of that scene down there. And I have been lucky to just kind of tangentially touch touch and go here and there. Um, so uh, I got to play this song at, uh, uh, this was at a concert in tribute to Alvin Batiste. Um, this one is called Chatterbox. Again, thank you for coming. Thank you for listening. Thank you guys for coming. Thank you, thank you. And, um, and keep winters in your thoughts too. We're trying to get this place open again. Uh, we're trying to get all these places open again. So yeah, let's open up. Get everything open, carefully, of course. Okay, so last tune, thank you again. Chatterbox.
Thank you. Thank you once again. Uh, a special shout out to all the cicadas that joined us for this set. It's really beautiful to do this outside. Uh, music outside is something I've we've done in like big places and street fairs and all this kind of stuff, but it's pretty special to do it in the yard. So thank you again. Thanks for joining us. Keep tuning into Winter's Jazz Club and you know, send me a line, joannedoherty.com. Thanks. That's really the end. Thank you again. <laughs>